Dennis job done today? Yeah, in the end, but they battled all the way, Kirby, didn't they? Um, and because of them going a goal in front, and we couldn't manage more than two, when we had obviously plenty of opportunities, it always made a game of it. And, you know, they battled and battled and battled the other team, so you've got to give them credit for that. And in the end, Mike's pulled off a save in the last two minutes that denied them a replay. So fair play for them, showing the spirit and character, never to give in. But just disappointed with our lot. Um, you know, with the attitude of some of the players today, I just thought we was really um, thought we were just going to turn up and win, and that's never the case in the FA Cup. He extends your good run though and gets you through. So admittedly, a disappointing performance at times for you, but. Like I've said, job done and you progress to Monday's draw now. Yeah, that's all you've got to do. I mean, it's weren't about the performance today. It was about winning and we got that. But, you know, it's just still sloppy defending, you know, sloppy decision making that's, you know, gifting the opp other team's opportunities. And if we'd have been playing a team at our level today, we'd have got punished for that sloppy decision making. So fortunately, we never and we're still in the cup. But, you know, as much as we're telling the players not to make these decisions, they seem to want to do do their own thing and it's really starting to grind me down um, and it will change because I'm not going to have the same players making the same decisions when we've been telling them for 12 games. Jay Rollins particularly bright today and got your winning goal, another good performance from him. Yeah thank God for Jay, you know he's come on a bundle, um, worked his socks off today, you know he's probably had six one-on-ones but the one he had to get was the important one which was getting us back in front very soon after going 1-0 down, I think it was about 15 minutes was back 2-1 in front. So, but we just need that third goal just to relax us because, you know, it was, it was so edgy. It's an FA Cup game and anything can happen. So, Jay Rollins done brilliant, as he does every single week. I don't think I've had to moan about Jay Rollins um, in all 12 games, but certainly other people really need to pull their finger out. Otherwise, they'll be playing at levels like this um, before long because that, that weren't good enough for, for at least four or five of them players today. If you're going to fall behind in a tie like this, presumably you want to do it after 10 minutes and not into the second half because you did have enough time to recover after what had been a decent start from your side? Yeah, that's the key. We started brightly, it looked like we could score goals and then against the run of play we'd give away a sloppy goal from a set piece. Um, but like you say, you know, we're back in front 2-1 after about 15 minutes later and it's one of them, it's like, put, make, play, makes the player's mindset again like it's too easy to go back in front so quickly and just wanted to do too much. The decision making, you know, wanting the ball in the wrong areas, it's not the best um, pitch for us and then the passing ain't sharp enough, the recovery ain't quick enough, um, the shape was poor at times and we just thought, oh, he can do it, he can do it. You know, the amount of times Jay Rollins won clean through one on one, if there was somebody that wanted a burst clear with him, he could have just rolled it alongside for him to tap it and open goal. But he's on his own every time, he bursts through, and there's nobody backing him up. It's like, oh, you go and do it, Jay. It's just not good enough. Um, really disappointed with the performance from some of the players today. But you're through, and chance to enter Monday's draw, and hopefully something favourable once again. Yeah, but I'm a realist, Craig. You know, it's all right being in the draw, but we want to go and win the next game and win the game after that and achieve something in the league. And if the players have that attitude today, we ain't going to achieve anything. So, you know, we've won an FA Cup game today, and I'm not even happy because I see the frailties in this team, um, and they can sort it out if they want to. But it's took 12 games so far, and they haven't. Holtingham next, winless in the league, but a late win over Gainsborough today. New manager, what are you expecting from them? Well, they're always going to improve, aren't they, with a new manager. Um, they needed bodies in, and I think they're steadily getting that. They've signed one or two this week. They'll probably sign one or two next week. So they'll be a different kind of animal to what's been playing in the first 10 or 11 games. So obviously, it's going to be a difficult game. History um, with us and Orchard hasn't been great. So, um, you know, we've just got to go there and give it our all. You know, I don't. I can stomach losing if everyone gives their all and we get beat by a better side. But this year, We've lost far too many games when we've gifted the other team the points, so we've got to knock that out of us.